I was reading a story. Oh, you can read? I can read. I did not know that. About immigrants coming to America and what people groups are the most dominant populace that come to the States. Okay. Unsurprisingly, the number one people Mexican. group are Mexicans. Mm -hmm. That's not a surprise. Second, Jai, Jai Hin, baby. Indians. Indians. Welcome to America. Just Hello. <laughs> Welcome to our stupid reactions. What accent was I that? I have no idea. Oh. False Saints, Scrum, Twitter, more juicy content. Thank you to the Patreon. Follow the account, subscribe, and the like button. Today we got a new trailer. It's a new trailer! With Vidyat Jam, Jam, Jamwal. <sighs> Smells good. Smells like it just came out of the oven. Vidyat Jamwal. Yes. Uh, who we saw in Commando. Yes. Uh, loved Commando. It was a lot yes. of fun. If you haven't seen a watch along of that, please go check that out. Unless it was blocked. If not, go to Patreon. Yes. Uh, also, Everything's on Patreon, including the pole dancing. Yes. Anupam Kaur is also hey. in this, but it's called IB71. You do? Yes. Wow. You don't look at... Uh, India's confidential victory remains a secret no more. Oh. It's a, a spy thriller, untold story of true events. Oh. Uh, top secret mission to save the nation. So I'm assuming action, obviously, with vid uh, video, right? I would assume so. And, I mean, I mean, the big takeaway about action is going to be Anupam Anupam Kerr. Kerr. Yeah, yeah. The his, major action star, I mean, Anupam Kerr. He's going to be kicking some daisies. <laughs> I was just thinking of something soft and Here gentle. we go. Better that. There he is. There he is. There he is. This <laughs> Oh, it was a teaser. That's a teaser, and that's a good one. Yeah, it was a teaser. Okay, sorry, I thought I, I, I said trailer to yeah. teaser, but yeah, right. I, I'm, nice. I'm very intrigued. You know who could he could him and um, Vicky Kershaw could play brothers. I feel. Like. Uh, yeah, very much so. Like very, very similar. Like look. They, they, I could easily believe them as brothers. Yep, a hundred percent. Um, but I, I'm, I'm already intrigued. One, if it's a true story, yeah, obviously, and I'm sure that'll be obviously heightened action with. Maybe or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he's he's doing something a little different. Could be subdued. Uh, maybe he's going for a little more performance. I don't know because I don't know this story. Mm -hmm. um, uh, let's see, if, sorry, I'm saving the screen here. But it lo right. looked good to me. I, the production quality, in oh terms yeah, of, like, the, the sets, everything, cinematography, really and everything looked really nice. So, uh, and obviously, the majority of you probably know this story. Well, at least you know about the 1971 uh, war, but uh, maybe not this particular story. Maybe. In it, in the same way, for example, not saying they're a similar film, I'm talking about subject matter where you find out a story that you didn't know existed that's part of a true story. The Imitation Game was one of those for me. Oh, yeah. Had no clue that was part of such an important part, part of World of War II. It, yeah. Great movie if you haven't seen that movie. Yes, it is. Two directors. True story. Two directors in this one. Lee Whitaker. Interesting. Maybe that he's like a second team director. I don't know. Or it's just like the Russo brothers or uh, the... This the... director is the director of the Gazi, uh, Gazi attack. Yeah. Which uh, we never saw, but I believe no. that's a... Atoll. Is Lairs Kulkarni. Om Puri. Whoa. Tapsi Panu. Yeah. Amitabh Bakchan. Chiranjivi. What there's, the crap? Yeah, there's a lot of people in this one. Um, but... We never saw it, obviously, so you guys could tell if that's worth a watch. But I've heard a lot about that. I yeah. think a lot of people like that Good film. Good grief. A, uh, a two-front war between India's intelligence agency and the Pakistan establishment. So maybe it's something similar to, like, the imitation game. Um, video t he produced this one. Nice. Mm. Uh, Amit Trivedi is the composer. Our dost. Mm. Or is he a bondu? What is he? I think he's a dost. Is he a dost? I think so. 
Okay. I could be wrong. But um, I think he's a ghost. Yeah, but I I be interested one just the cast I I enjoyed Vidyat in um in the little we saw of him in, in Commando. Mm-hmm. Uh, obviously, that was mostly just an action film, like yeah. uh, Stallone style. But I think he's has enough chops, at least from what I saw, that he could probably do something like this. But also, maybe this has a a bunch of action. But I, from my looking, it might have some action, but I don't think it's going to be a heavy action like a Commando. No, I, I I agree. I think it'll have a couple of action sequences, but for the most part, this is going to be a thriller that's going to take turns and you're going to not know who's doing what and is is that person a really a good person or are they an enemy i'm intrigued very intrigued um and anupam kur uh, <laughs> as long as he's uh he has such a i guess you could call it a range right <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, because he's actually a very good actor. Like he was probably one of the best parts of that 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 film that everybody liked that we didn't. Uh, Cashmere, the Cashmere Files. He put on a great performance. He's he's a. It's odd because he is a thespian, yet <laughs> there's been times, and I'm sure you know what it was. I, I promise you, it's the 90s just times. He's an actor that just does what the directors tell him to do. Yeah, and so they wanted that him was the big and over the top. That was the that style. was the style of the day, and he just gave them. The, I'm I'm here to serve your vision and to serve the story. So what do you want me to do? Because he was probably, I mean, outside of learning, you know, about that event uh, of of the Kashmir Files, uh, but he his performance I thought was very good in that in that movie. I'm always if I see his name in something, I'm I know he's going to turn in something of substance. It's going to be a good performance. Um, the, sorry, oh wait, what did I just? No, it's not who I. I thought I saw somebody that I recognized. Anyways, uh, looks interesting to me. Uh, I, it comes out May twelfth, so I assume we'll get a trailer, a full blown in a week or two, first week of May. First probably. week of May. Right? Yeah. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Um, and it doesn't have a, a runtime or anything yet, but yeah, it's shaping up to be a, a, a good year, hopefully, for, for films so far. Um, let us know what you thought about this. Any other information we need to know that without spoiling, obviously, anything um, that we need to know down below. Josh!